Yes. Tina Harrington and Rick Peranian became parents in January of 1983. They named their baby girl Holly. My firstborn child, our Holly. When Holly's parents were working, Rick's mother, Maureen, looked after her granddaughter. She was a pleasure. She was no trouble at all. She was a sweet little girl. The Peranians vacationed at a cottage by a lake in Sturbridge. Happy summer days for a little girl who wanted to be a marine biologist. She was going to be able to swim with the dolphins, and that was her goal at 10 years old. Seven months after her 10th birthday, August 5th, 1993, Holly left the cottage to see a litter of puppies down the road. She was given a little bit of freedom that summer. Later, her dad sent her brothers after her. They couldn't find her. And they had found just her shoe. Rick called the police. We knew something really bad had happened because we knew she wouldn't have gone off walking in the woods without both of her shoes on. And lifting up trash can lids to see if your daughter is in there and screaming out her name and praying that she was going to be OK. Days turned to weeks, weeks to months, no sign of Holly. On October 23rd, three months after Holly's disappearance, hunters found her remains in the woods of Brimfield. The pain never goes away. The only thing is that you get used to the pain. It was the worst, worst time of my life. Nothing compares to burying a child. Nothing's been the same ever since. 25 years after Holly's disappearance, no one has been charged in her murder. The Hamden County DA and state police detectives continue to work on the case. It doesn't feel like it's been 25 years, most, most days, and then sometimes it feels like it was a lifetime ago. Her friends have grown up and gotten married and have children, and we say, that could be her. 25 years later, we're still missing this beautiful little girl. The Peranian family hopes a $40,000 reward, most of it from donations, will trigger clues leading to a conviction of Holly's murderer. A text-a-tip campaign began in the fall. Just to keep it out there in the public and try to get more tips to come in. Just need the right person to say the right thing. Holly's mother hopes the killer will confess. Please confess. Please. This, how, you can't forgive somebody when you don't know who the person is. Meanwhile, the family grieves what might have been. Maybe she wouldn't have been a marine biologist. Maybe she would have been something else. But that choice was taken away from her. We really need to find out the person or persons who are responsible for this. We need to be able to understand what happened. Why, why did you do this?